What's going on ladies and gentlemen? We're here at Horseshoe Valley Bike Park and we are looking at the new Smith Thriller Trail and it is going to be the race trail for Bike Fest on the downhill race and it's never been raced before this year so I've done about eight runs now my legs are fully cramped up but I want to take you along with me on sort of a course walk even though I'm just gonna ride pretty slow seems like there's no one behind me um, but I think it'll be cool for anyone who hasn't been able to check it out before race day. Uh, I've kind of got the lines figured out, the fast and slow lines. So come along with me and I'll show you what is good. So this trail is the gnarliest one here by far and it's got multiple lines and a lot of them are really rutted up where sometimes it seems like there's a faster line, but really if you just compress, you let your wheel get into the rut and just compress and let it eat, it actually shoots you fastest. So. That's the main thing to think about before even looking at it, but here we are at the top. It's a new run-in with a little wood ladder. You can kind of jump this first section. I don't know if it's faster or not, but the middle seems to be the smoothest. Shoots you through the gate, and there's some gnarly little stumps you can see. I like to go wide here. But here's the first example of a rut where you just let your back wheel eat and it flies you through. This section, this inside line I just took, it's more awkward to come into but it's faster out where that wide line is faster and slower out. This section's pretty gnarly. This is kind of the only feasible line. Whips you around the berm here. This is the first section where you got some real options. So this is the slow line. That's the medium line because you kind of got to come at an awkward angle. This surprisingly is the fast angle where it just kind of cuts the angle and if you dodge the two trees here, choo -choo, it shoots you straight through, but it goes drop, drop. That's the play. You can see the little nubs. That's the fast line, medium, slow. Whichever one you take, it's gonna shoot you down this really steep hill here. You wanna go high on this left berm. And now that there's a post here, you wanna get really wide because it's you want to shoot off that without flying off the right side there like I did a couple times. You can get some good air off that. This section's interesting. You come in blind, but you air off this fella and there's a stump about yay. So you want to come off the right side here and you launch and you land about here and you get huge speed and come up wide here. Here's one of these ruts. You come low and you compress. That's the fast line. Up high, compress, compress. You can get a couple pedal strokes in here. And this is the next section where you got a couple options. Up there is like the fast flow line. I don't know if this flat section's faster, but what I found the best is hitting this jump and just landing kind of straight there. That seems to be the play. It's pretty tight in here. You can see where a couple people have caught pedals and probably went over the bars. You're flying at this section when you're at race pace. This awkward section with the root, you're actually best to like compress it rather than get air. Just keeps your traction good. Left on these roots, left on these roots. Get a little air, but again, just compress. This is a nice hip where you kind of shoot and swing around. This jump launches you into this berm. You maybe get a pedal stroke in here and then this step up just launches you, but that's it, that's the Smith Thriller Trail. And it is fun, it is fast, it is short, and it is gnarly. So I hope this video helps you kind of see before you come here what lines to do and saves you a couple runs messing around. But anyways, that's it for me. The leg is fully cramped up. The race is on Sunday. And I hope to see you goons out there. Peace, have fun. Yo. Oh, and last note, I'll put my, I got another video going kind of race pace that I'll post so you can see what those runs actually look like in action. Hopefully you can hear me with the wind here, but anyways, peace.